couple through networking can be done both online and offline and it is really 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 important to remember that networking is for sharing it's for giving and getting without any pressure without any compulsion it is not about selling so when you're networking it's about building relationships it is not about making sales um, the way to do it when you approach networking if you're starting out listen for what the other people need and if possible offer help uh, build trust and reliability so that they're not wondering whether you're trying to sell something it will take a while okay this does not happen overnight people may wonder why are you offering to help me well show them that you're genuine show that you are willing to just help without getting anything in return when you build that trust and reliability that's when people start calling upon you and that's when your networks um, actually grow there are some um, social codes to observe. You need to be businesslike and friendly and stay warm, but very professional. Do not cross in networking. Do not cross that boundary of getting personal, of flirting, of gossiping. All of those things don't help you to build your networks. They actually uh, belong to a different uh, arena of forming relationships. Networking should be very casual in approach without form formality or familiarity and so there's a very very thin line so you need to be warm casual friendly and yet remain professional and uh, just just don't cross the personal boundaries and you'll be fine focus on why you are engaging you know when you go to a networking group or to a meeting there is a purpose there is a core reason for being there so focus on that and don't deviate from that the people whom you want to do business with it is really quite good to make sure you establish that trust and reliability before becoming friends because then the friendship will have a much much higher value until you become friends and start exchanging baby photos and things like that you know it is much better to to build that trust uh, and uh, professionalism um, okay what are some of the other tips that I can give you vary your personality to make the other person feel comfortable what i mean by that it's you must never never be insincere that core you must never change it must always be very consistent but you know just like a chameleon it's about using terms phrases that the other group is comfortable and familiar with uh, sharing food that people like you know without losing your core value because once you lose your identity your own brand has been lost your own value has been lost which means that you can be replicated you can be duplicated and that's when you lose your value so flexibility will accommodate those people around of different ages cultures professions uh, without losing who you are can it be done offline and online simultaneously yes I think very successfully. I, I think um, one or the other is not necessarily so. It's quite good to, to keep in touch. But frequency is very important because um, in networking, absence does not make the heart grow fonder. You actually do got to stay on people's minds. They need to know who you are, what you're doing, uh, why they need to keep in touch with you, update people on your relationships, uh, be respectful of gender and religions very very important uh, especially when everything is like anything goes these days so we never know who we're dealing with what's important to them what's sensitive to them so it's great to be respectful in all of those respects and these are really some of the key points to networking successfully and maintaining your networks having said all of that is it always just happy happy joy joy positive no you just you do need to know where your boundaries are and if something is wrong politely graciously tell someone no this is not acceptable uh, but also tell them that it's not personal it's just professional you're not rejecting them and you never know if that person accepts it you could have a very long-term relationship from there happy networking <laughs>